you imagine it was that easy? You just bring your suitcases in and you're moved? That'd be so nice. This was the day I got my keys, but we had flown in super late that night. So we just got there, went and grabbed some toilet paper and a few essentials and went to sleep. The next day is when everything kind of started. We went to Ikea and tried our best to get as much as we could. So me and my parents just went to Ikea and they bought me this stuff. So I'm very grateful. He's getting acquainted with the place, but otherwise it's pretty empty. I do have my bed that just came in. We got some essentials like a garbage can. Couldn't get as much as I wanted because we have to take an Uber since it's Montreal, so we don't have a car. But this beautiful duvet, but it's gonna be really nice. I've never had a duvet this thick in my life. Got some basic, these aren't like anything crazy. It's just a like starter set. I got just a, what do you call these? A dish mat and these little, got some scissors, duty coasters, clips. I actually forgot I got these. Then I got some cutlery, silver ones, some cutting boards. Wait, I gotta show you Bob right now. This is Bob while I'm doing this. And then this gorgeous set of glasses. It's like these ones. They're kind of like black, but they're more brown in person. Toilet brush, thing to put your plates on, on the dish mat that I got. I just got one little pan just to start off with. And then I got some more towels. I have, these look really hot pink. They are actually this hot pink in person as well. I got some little blue washcloths. I don't know what I was doing with the color theme here, but got this cutie little mug. Then I got two more. We had to awkwardly package them in my towels. <laughs> then the classic Ikea like see-through one. Oh, dishes, the best part. These yellow bowls, I just got two. I don't know how to buy for someone living alone. And then these two plates that have like blue splatters on them. Didn't even know I had sold these, but they're so cute. I think this is the last thing. A bath mat. I got gray because I had so many colors going on with my towels. I didn't want to get something that was fully not matching. But that's everything I got. And then I just got my bed delivered. And yeah, I got to clean everything still and then put everything away. groceries first official groceries i honestly don't have knives yet so i don't know how we're gonna cut this cucumber but we're gonna figure it out so i got a bunch of little cleaning products over here because we have to kind of do our own cleaning if you know you know got some pears some mayonnaise can opener mandarins a couple apples dad's cookies because they're the best white bread more soap butter, some milk, honeycomb cereal, and then I got some, I know I'm kind of dramatic, I got some hypoallergenic Kleenex, yogurt, some Ziploc bags, carrot muffins that I'll probably have to freeze because I probably will not be able to eat these all by myself before they go bad, and then a classic uh, tato sick. If you're not from Quebec, you probably don't know what this is, but it's basically just like sugar pie, and it's really good, and that's the haul. So we just had breakfast in my place for the first time. Now we're about to go to Winners in Dollarama to grab some things. And then we're hoping to rent a car and get stuff at Ikea tomorrow, or tonight, because we have literally no way to get furniture back here other than delivery. So yeah, and Bob's just gonna be here. <laughs> he looks so shook. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, so I barely filmed anything yesterday because it was the most hectic day ever. We were going to Dollarama, bought like so much kitchen stuff at Dollarama because it's kind of underrated when you're starting out. And then we went to Ikea, um, but we had rented a car so we actually could pick up furniture this time. Well, this one was actually from Winners. This is from a cat. It's a scratching post. Then this is like a little cube with legs. It will be my nightstand. I'll show it when it's built. And then there's just this huge box for the shoe rack for the entrance. Then I got a bunch of stuff on Amazon, but I'll show you guys what I got once it's all organized. <laughs> Okay, so I went to look at my school for my classes and see where they all are. And now we're at Ikea again while we still have the rental to get my bed because we weren't sure if it was gonna fit in this car. But now we measured and we're gonna see if maybe my coffee table is restocked, which I don't think it will be, but here's hoping. Okay, so we got back from Ikea and we got our bed and we're opening up the box right now to build it. Went to Walmart, got a kettle because I need to make some French press coffee. And then I got this beautiful smart toaster. And now I'm just having the tato sick because I need something to eat to continue on. And I also, or actually I shouldn't say I, my parents did this, but put this little thing out front for shoes. Fits the shoes perfect. So that's what we got going on now. And now we're gonna build a bed and then maybe the nightstand later if we have time. We'll see, the bed seems kind of complicated. So... So it's the next day and we decided to take a chill morning, have some breakfast, and now we're out at Columbus Cafe to get some coffee. I got a matcha here with oat milk. It looks pretty good. And then just a muffin with uh, raspberries in it. Okay, so we got back from going to the cafe and then we went to the Structube and saw a nice TV console. And I have a couch that I need to order and a coffee table that was out of stock. But anywho, so I did some taping with my sister and that would be the coffee table, or not the coffee table, the TV console. And then this is the coffee table. And the couch is kind of large and in charge. But yeah, this is the setup. This is the thought process. Now we're gonna go to dinner. It's been a couple days. I swear moving is the most hectic thing to vlog. I just had my first day back to school and now I just want to show a little update of the space. I got my bed up and then I, I got a duvet cover and I don't know if you guys get the vision. It looks kind of strange right now. Like you, maybe the way that I'm, this blanket, if it wasn't here, you'd get it more, but it's like pink with a burgundy duvet cover. But I had to put this here because my cat, I forgot that his like little belly hairs are blonde. So you can see it all over the duvet. So I'm gonna find a different blanket to like put at the end here where he sleeps. And then I'll just have to get like a little lint roller thing 
to fix that. And then I'm pretty sure I'd already mentioned the nightstand, or maybe I only filmed putting it there, but I have the nightstand, the little lamp, which I'm obsessed with this. I just have to put my two other pillows in front and then kind of like fold it. You'll see the vision once it's done. But I got the coffee table today and now we're about to build it. And then I might be ordering a TV stand to go right here. The couch is a big problem. I am gonna have to get it delivered most likely. Anyways, I have a bed to sit on and then I'm gonna have a coffee table, slap some pillows on the ground, eat off the coffee table. So that's the update. I'm gonna build this. Okay, I don't even know what this vlog is anymore, but I have my little bed made how it's supposed to look, but I do have a blanket here. So Bob's hair doesn't stick all over the burgundy cover. And then this is the coffee table. I think she's so cute. I'm obsessed. It is so hot today. Oh, I matched my bed. Funny little culture shock thing. Not really a shock, but they only do paper cups in Quebec, even for ice drinks, which is kind of fun. Different, but fun. Um, I got my free birthday drink because it's my birthday today. My parents left this morning, so I'm like alone in the city for the first time, essentially. Except for, of course, I have Bob. So I'm never really alone. Right, Bobby? He's more cuddly now that we're over here. I don't know why. Okay, I think I'm gonna make a little Greek type salad thing with a side of croissant because I had croissants and I fully forgot because they were in like a top shelf that I didn't see. So it's a bit upsetting, uh, but they're still good. So I'm gonna use some these. I'm gonna use the rest of my cucumber because there's not much left. Got some feta. And it's 1.30, so I probably won't eat until like six o'clock. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Oh, I don't have any dishcloths. That's awkward. Okay, let me figure this out. Let me figure this out. I'm aware I could use a bigger knife for this, but I wanna use this knife for the tomatoes too. And my other knife doesn't have like little teeth thing to get through. So just don't judge me. I just moved in, okay? Okay, so this is what we're working with. I have more cucumber than tomato, but it's because I want to finish my cucumber first. Also, these knives are from Dollarama. And why are they kind of better than really expensive knives? Just saying. So I have my little salad here with the cucumber, baby tomato, feta. I put some olive oil, a little bit of white vinegar, salt and pepper, just cause I don't have much seasoning. Then I have my Starbucks, which I forgot to say, but don't mind the sirens. Um, I got the, oh geez, okay, it's in French. So it's, it's the Oliato Golden Shaking Espresso. That's what this is, but it's just written in French. And then a croissant with butter because I have to eat through my croissants and now I'm about to watch YouTube and then probably doing my readings. Then I'm gonna kind of chill for the rest of the day because it is my birthday. So I'm gonna try to have a fun little day. I look crazy and just takes up so much room. So I love a little pack. You can just take out many ever you need. Okay, so I, I went and did my reading. Ooh, this exposure. I did my reading for the day and then I was like, okay, I gotta go out and get myself a little rosé for dinner because it's my birthday here. And then I was like, okay, like let me find a little sweet treat, like a, something small for myself. Like, let me go to Uncle Tetsu, get a little cheesecake. And then she's like, oh, okay, cool, that's everything? I'm like, yep. Or, well, she was, we were speaking French, but, and then she says the price, I was like, uh, and then she starts unfolding the bag, and it's the big one. And then I was like, I was too embarrassed to be like, not embarrassed, but I was like, this is just too awkward for us, for me to just like retract. I don't know, I was like, you know what, whatever. Maybe it was meant to be that I ordered the accidental wrong cheesecake thing, okay? So I got the big one. So I'm gonna have this for dessert. Anyways, I'm gonna go do that. <laughs> 